I am your host, Michael Yerby. It's another lovely day in Shreveport, Louisiana. We are five hours away from New Orleans, three hours away from Dallas, but I'm just one minute from getting in your butt if you haven't gotten up to start your day. Welcome to the Breakfast Boost. Happy New Year's, Boosters. Welcome to the special episode of The Breakfast Boost. I'm your host, Michael Yerby, and today we got something exciting lined up. But first, let me share a quick joke with you. Why don't goal setters play hide and seek? Because good goals always stand out. Now, as we start the new year, it's a perfect time to pause and reflect on our previous year. It's been a year of highs, maybe a few lows, but most importantly, a year of learning and growing. Today, we're diving into the year in review episode. We are celebrating our wins, big and small, and setting our sights on new horizons. It's about taking those successes, learning from our experiences, and gearing up for an even more successful year ahead. So grab your coffee or your breakfast smoothie, and let's get started. We got a lot to cover from reflecting on the past year to setting meaningful goals for new ones. And who knows, we might even inspire each other to create some awesome vision boards. Stay tuned because at the end of the episode, I'll give you a sneak peek into next week's topic, creating morning routines by structure equals success. Trust me, it's something you won't want to miss as we step into a new year of growth and achievement. Good morning, Boosters. It's Michael here, and you're tuned in to the Wake Up Wisdom segment of our special Year in Review episode. Today, I want to start with something really got me thinking. Here's a quote from Mia Hamm. You know Mia Hamm. Celebrate what you accomplish, but raise the bar a little bit higher each time you succeed. Now, let's unpack that a bit. It's like when you finish a puzzle, you feel great, right? But then you really have a bigger puzzle next time. That's what Mia Hamm is saying. It's awesome to give yourself a pat on the back for what you've done, but don't stop there. Think about what's next. What's your next big puzzle? Last year, we all done some pretty cool things. Maybe you started a new hobby, got better at something, or helped someone out. That's amazing. But what about this year? How can you take the next step? Maybe it's improving that new hobby, taking a bigger project, or helping even more people. Remember, It's not just about those big wins. Those small steps matter a lot. They add up. Every little thing you do, get better or to help others, adds up to something huge. So as we talk today, think about your own wins from last year. Big or small, they all are worth celebrating. And then let's dream about what's next. How can you challenge yourself this year? I bet you got some great ideas. And hey, if you got a win and you're proud of it or a goal for this year, share it with us. Use the hashtag Boost New Year Goals on social media. Let's inspire each other. Welcome back, Boosters. This is Michael Yerby, and you're right in the heart of our special episode, year review, celebrating wins, and setting new goals. Let's dive in. First up, let's talk about this past year. It's like looking through a photo album, right? You see the big moments. Maybe you got a new job, starting a business, or learning a new skill. These are the headline moments, and they're super important. But don't forget about the small pictures in the album. The daily wins, like sticking to a new routine, reading more, or just being there for a friend. These moments are like the glue that holds your year together. Let's take a moment to give ourselves a high five for those wins, big and small. Now let's shift gears a bit. Not every picture in our album is bright and shiny. We all face challenges and setbacks. I know I have. But here's the thing. These moments are not just roadblocks, but they're stepping stones. They teach us, strengthen us, and often lead us to new paths we never expected. Think about a tough moment you had last year. What did it teach you? How did it grow you? It's the lessons that set the stage for our future success. All right, it's goal setting time. Setting goals for this year can be exciting, 
but also a bit daunting. The key is to make them beautiful and achievable. Start small if you need to. Maybe it's improving a skill, dedicating the time to a hobby, or even just making more time for yourself. What matters is these goals resonate with you and motivate you. Stay motivated and accountable. That's our next big thing. A tip I found super helpful. Share your goals with someone, a friend, family member, or hey, even our Breakfast Boost community. When you speak your goals out loud, they become more real. Plus, it's always great to have a cheerleader on your journey. And speaking of journeys, I want to share some incredible stories from you, our listeners. First up, we have Jamie. Jamie shared with us at the start of the year, she decided to learn Spanish. It wasn't easy balancing work and study, but guess what? Jamie stuck with it and practiced every day, and now Jamie can have full conversations in Spanish. He even made a few Spanish friends in the Spanish-speaking community. That's perseverance and dedication right there. Now let's talk about Marcus. Marcus had never ran more than a mile before this year, but he set a goal to run a marathon. Day by day, mile by mile, he trained. And just last month, Marcus crossed the finish line for his first ever marathon. He said it was tough, but what is one of the most rewarding experiences of his life? What an incredible achievement, Marcus. Finally, there's Selena's story. Selena turned her baking hobby into a small business this year. She started by sharing her creations on social media, and soon, orders started rolling in. Selena is now running a successful home-based bakery and has even been featured in global establishments, talking about turning your passions into success. Great job, Selena. These stories are what this community is all about. I want you to share some of your incredible stories on our Discord and WhatsApp communities with our listeners to inspire and support each other. Before we wrap up this segment, let's take a quick moment to think about what we want this year's photo album to look like. What are those big pictures you want to see? And don't forget the small ones. They are just as important. Remember, you can always reach out on social media with your stories and goals using the hashtag Boost New Year Goals. Let's make this an interactive journey. Hey there, Boosters. It's Michael Yerby back with you, and now it's time for our Boost of the Day. This is where we turn our words into action. Today, we're all about vision boards. Yes, you heard right, vision boards. They're like a map for your dreams and goals. So what's a vision board? Imagine a poster where you put pictures and words that represent what you want to achieve. It's like a collage of your future. And the best part, it is super fun to make and powerful way to keep your goals in sight, literally. Here's how you can make a simple one. Grab some magazines, a poster board, or even just pieces of paper. Look for images and words that inspire you. It could be a dream vacation, a new skill you want to learn, or feelings you want more of, like peace and joy. Cut these out and arrange them on your board. There are no right or wrong way to do this. It's all about what speaks to you. Once you're done, put your vision board somewhere you can see it every day. Maybe on your desk, on your fridge, or next to your mirror. This way, it reminds you of what you're working towards every day. And here's the fun part. I want to see your vision boards. Share them on social media with the hashtag Boost New Year Goals. Let's flood the internet with hopes and dreams. It's a great way to inspire each other and stay connected. Before we move to our wrap up, take a moment to really look at your vision board. Feel the excitement of those dreams and goals. This year is going to be a journey of making those images a reality. And I can't wait to see where it takes us all this year. Stay tuned for our wrap up where I'll recap today's episode and give you a sneak peek into the next exciting topic. You won't want to miss it. All right, Boosters, we're at the end of today's special episode and what our journey has been. I'm Mike Yerby, and I want to wrap things up with a quick recap and a peek 
at What's Coming Next Week. Today, we took a stroll down memory lane, celebrating the wins of the past year. We talked about the big moments and the small, everyday victories that make our lives special. We also embraced our challenges, turned them into lessons for the future. Then we dove into setting goals for this year. Remember, your goals should be as unique as you are. And don't forget to make that vision board. It is a fun and powerful way to keep your dreams in sight. We also share some amazing stories from our listeners. You guys are incredible. Your achievements and ambitions are what make this community so very special. Now, it's a little teaser from our next episode. We explore creating morning routines, why structure equals success. It will be a fantastic session with tips and tricks to kickstart your mornings. You definitely wouldn't want to miss it. Before we sign off, a big thank you for tuning in. Remember to share today's episode with your friends, subscribe for more awesome content, and let's step into this year of growth and achievement together. And don't forget to follow the Breakfast Boost on Discord and WhatsApp for your daily dose of motivation and community support. And just like that, we're at the end of another fantastic episode of The Breakfast Boost. I'm Michael Yerby, and I had a blast being with you all last year. As we close off, I want to remind you to carry the spirit of today's episode with you. Celebrate every win, big or small, and get excited about setting those new goals. Remember, it's not just about reaching the destination, it's about enjoying the journey along the way. If today's episode inspires you, share the love, tell your friends, post it on your socials, and let's spread the word. Don't forget to subscribe to Spotify, YouTube, and Apple channels for more inspiring content because together we step into this year filled with growth and achievement. And hey, follow the Breakfast Boots on Twitter or X, Instagram, and LinkedIn. We got daily motivation and the community here to support you every step of the way on Discord and WhatsApp. Thank you for joining me today. I cannot wait to have you back for our next episode as we dive into creating morning routines, why structure equals success. It's going to be a game changer. Until then, this is Michael Yerby signing off. Keep boosting, keep shining, and see you next time.